here in the Audi Sport Team Phoenix dressing room together with Mike Rockefeller. Mike, great to have you here. The first time in your seventh DTM season, you're the leader of the standings. Must be a good feeling. It's not too bad, you know, to come uh, to a race weekend as the leader in the championship. But at the end of the day, uh, I would love to be in that position after the last race. So it's not very important, but it's nice to be, uh, let's say, in the front, to be in the hunt for the lead or to be to be there um, and uh, to know you have already scored some points and uh, yeah, still able to, to fight for the championship. So that's a great feeling for sure. And it's really tight there in the front, actually. Let's talk about the qualifying yesterday. You finished P8. Uh, how happy are you? <laughs> well, uh, not really happy, but on the other hand, we had a difficult qualifying. I was struggling basically in every session to, to come through to the next session. Then in Q3, I was able to uh, maybe to do a lap which was enough for P4. So therefore, I'm uh, unhappy with myself that I didn't do it in the last corner. I, I made a mistake. But um, generally, it's so tight here in this championship. It's so close together. Small mistakes, um, you know, are, you can see it on the list after the qualifying. And therefore, um, yeah, we are. Well, we were P8, and um, that's um, in DTM not a shame, but it's not what we wanted. But today in the grid, you're starting from P13. What happened? Yeah, yesterday in free practice, we uh, there was a yellow um, at the very end. Uh, one Mercedes stopped on the track. And uh, there's a rule which is pretty uh, yeah, nonsense, I would say, this year, that you have to be five tenths slower in that sector. It's in the race and it's in free practice as well. So uh, I did my quick lap before the yellow came out, no problem. Then I slowed down the next lap. and the third lap, I was two seconds slower or something, but I was a bit too quick in the last sector where the yellow was. So I, in my point of view, I was very safe and nothing happened really slow on the lap time. But of course, there's a rule and uh, I unfortunately didn't follow the rule. Therefore, I get a penalty, which is very disappointing. Uh, when you are fighting for the championship, um, but it's we have to take it like this. The race uh, is today, and uh, you know we still can manage to be uh, in the points, hopefully, and uh, try to make the best out of it. What's going on for the race today? What are your expectations? Uh, well, we have we have to see um, how the car is going, um, you know, in all the conditions, and I, I mean we think we have a good car we hope we have a good strategy and i try to push every lap as hard as i can and uh, therefore i think uh, there's a lot possible for us and uh, we are optimistic always till the flag drops okay thank you very much mike rockenfeller and yeah we're gonna look forward to an exciting race today